Hi everybody! Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rebecca and today I just wanted to share with you guys three of my really bad habits that just seem to cause, like fuel my insecurities. I wanted to share this because I also want to challenge you guys to identify some of the bad habits that you guys may have that's just really not helping with your insecurities. So without further to do, let's just get right into it. So the first bad habit that I have is not accepting my reality. I think these days with the internet and social media, it's so easy to live your life thinking that there is something better and that you are not reaching your fullest potential. But right now, like I have to accept that this is my life. Like right now for me, my life is taking care of my dog and you know even as annoying as it is <laughs> taking care of him feeding him taking him out to go to the bathroom you know and also you know working my job as a job coach and doing some of the most mundane things you could possibly imagine some days i'm literally sitting at a restaurant just watching one of my clients hold silverware like for two hours that's literally what i'm doing that's just my life right now and i think if i had this mentality of like there's something better out there i'm gonna miss what's happening right now in this season of my life the second bad habit that i have is becoming so fixated and meditating on my worst self last year was a season where I seriously experienced like the worst side of me. I hated it, I was so ashamed of it and embarrassed by it and so ridden with guilt. These demons in my head kept telling me that's all that you can be. And obviously I'm right because look at what how you acted, look at what you did to other people, look at all these things. If you get so fixated on like your past mistakes, you'll never be able to see the potential that you have, which for me is like, at my worst self, I could be this controlling, like jealous, self-centered person, but at my best self, I could be this most joyous, like generous and freaking genuine and kind and compassionate and driven and passionate person. And so try to learn from my mistakes, but really focus more on who I am at my best and really work towards becoming that even more. So the third lie that I've been telling myself is that life should be taken really, really seriously. I'm someone that's kind of has been more serious in the past. Like I remember being that older youth sister who's like, you guys are all like bad, don't go on a date unless it's serious. I think this makes me more insecure because it makes me think so much about my life and think so much about just making the right decisions. I think life is already too serious. And so I think it's important to kind of go, go with the flow and take life as it comes at you. And so now my motto is have fun, but at the same time you wanna be wise instead of like taking life too seriously. And I could honestly say like, I've been learning to, I guess, create my own happiness and to love myself more in the season. I could like, like feel it in my brain and in my heart that I'm being molded right now and it's such a painful process, but it's um, it's been really great at the same time. And so I don't know what you guys are going through right now, but I hope that um, whatever it is that you could trust God and know that he has what's best for you. Anyways, thanks for watching guys. I hope this was helpful and I'll see you guys next time. Bye Milo, say bye. Bye. <laughs>